What's up, everybody? It is Friday afternoon. We are drinking some whiskey. As a matter of fact, we're drinking some Jameson today. So we actually were at the Jameson Distillery back in December? Yeah. Yes, we went back in, in December when we went over there to take a look at it. Uh, it's a great Irish whiskey, of course. You can find this at every bar on the planet. I don't think there's a single bar that doesn't have this. Uh, fantastic whiskey, in our opinion. Irish whiskey, of course, has three distinct characteristics. Pot distilled, triple distilled, and a portion of it has to be um, malted barley. Unmalted barley. Unmalted. It's a mix. It, yeah, it's a mix of malted and unmalted barley. The reason why they use uh, a percentage of unmalted barley is because of taxation from the English. So we won't get into that. That's a little boring. We just want to taste some whiskey this evening. So as always, first straight up, then on the rocks, then with some Coca Cola. A little help. I can never do this with one hand. I do lots of things with one hand, but uh, opening bottles is not one of them. <laughs> Annie, that's not even what I meant. Glug, 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 glug. Okay. So, let's put that on there. Mmm. Uh, like, like, basically, pretty much every Irish whiskey I've ever had, to a certain extent, it is, to me, I, 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 I smell baked goods when I smell that. I get, like, like um, um, this one specifically, for some reason, is um, a banana bread. Is, is what I smell. A little bit of cinnamon, and then mostly it's just like I get that, I, I for some reason I smell mom's banana bread. I don't know, what do you think? I, I definitely get the, the caramel and the vanilla. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for me, Irish whiskey. With the exception of Black Bush. Black Bush has a lot of fruit uh, notes in it, but uh, Jameson and Red Breast in particular, baked goods for me. It's, it, it, to me, it smells like a bakery, so. But, let's give it a try, assholes and elbows. Oh, that is so good. Very full-bodied. Not like everything else in here. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yes, yeah, very full-bodied. has great legs, so it means sugar, sugar content is pretty high in it. I think, I think it's, this is great. This, you get like a, um, uh, again, like that uh, little bit of, like, like, hint, like undertone of cinnamon, but mostly it's like uh, bread and cream and, and butter is, is what I'm tasting from that. What about you? I get, I still get the vanilla, mm -hmm. a lot of the vanilla. Um, I'm not getting oak. too much vanilla. Hmm. Mm. The red breast is much, sorry, much smoother. Whether it's better or not, the thing is, this is less than half the price of the red breast, so, you know, if you're on a budget, this is the Irish whiskey for you. Oh, let's throw a little bit in there. Up. So of course, on the rocks. I'm gonna give that a smell, Annie. I definitely smell more baked goods. Yep. With the ice does yet. it open it right up? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Mmm. Yes. It's like walking into a bakery. Mmm. Really good. This is how I drink it. Is on the rocks. This particular whiskey. Oh, it's like a big, big sip there. Like, oh. But um, yeah, pretty much the same. It's 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 like. Baked bread, like with butter, cream, um, you know, like maybe, am I getting a toasted nuts in there as well? Me, a little bit of toasted it nuts in like there? like Christmas. Yeah. I don't know what Christmas, <laughs> I don't know what Christmases were like at her house, but okay. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's, it's just tasty. Yeah. Mm. Red breast is better, definitely smoother and uh, better flavor, but uh, that ain't bad for, for what it, what it is, but. I really like this as well with, with some Coca-Cola. We actually have a friend whose name is Paul Longo who really likes Jameson. He used to bring over trays of, well, probably still does to this day, bring over trays of shots uh, to tables. And everybody's like, ah, I'm good. And just would j -j 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 fucking shotgun them. So. I think we need to hang out with Paul Longo. Mm, delici <laughs> yeah, probably. Delicioso. Mmm. Mm. Oh, I need to yeah, cut this a little bit. That's much better with the Coke. I think about the Coke, eh? Mm -hmm. See, I, this I can drink, I can definitely drink uh, straight up around the rocks, this particular whiskey. Because the Irish whiskeys are just so much uh, softer. This is, I, I find this, um, I, I heard this described like this, and I, I think I agree, it's approachable. I think yeah. for people who don't drink that much whiskey, this is not going to put you off to it. It's not particularly bold and going to like, oh my God, like, whoa, what am I tasting? It's a good starter whiskey, in my opinion. One of the better ones for sure. Now that's Christmas. 
Again, I guess Christmases were uh, pretty crazy in the Slaco household by the sense of things, eh? But, so, Annie, what do you think of Jameson Irish whiskey? I think it's great. Me too. And the um, tour was great too. With yeah, the tour was a lot of fun. Uh, if anybody ever goes to Dublin, Ireland, uh, definitely one of the things on your bucket list should be the Jameson Distillery. It's not a working distillery. It's the original site, but they don't actually produce the, the liquor there. They just they, they give you a tour and give you a rundown on how everything's produced. So, But uh, you actually, aren't you a little bit Irish? Because mm -hmm. when I look at you, my penis is Dublin. <laughs> <laughs> We should have saved that under the Annie jokes <laughs> yeah. call and whatever, but but uh, yeah, uh, definitely recommend uh, Jameson Irish whiskey. Um, is it better than like let's say a Redbreast? Grab the Redbreast, Annie, would you? Is it better than a Redbreast? No, not by a long shot, but it's not. It's certainly not too bad. Uh, let's try a little bit. Um, ah, we don't have any clean thing. Forget it. Who cares? But uh, this is like eighty dollars. This is like thirty. Two dollars or something I think like that. That's so, the smaller one. It well, the, like yeah, this this one's a small 16. version. I, I um, <laughs> only have this right now. When you normally have a bigger bottle, but but um, yeah, that's this that, yeah, that's the normal one. But uh, Annie ha apparently had some, and <laughs> Annie likes to put empty bottles back. So that's what she does. But there we go. But uh, absolutely, Jameson Irish whiskey, one hundred percent recommend. Uh, I started out maybe trying it with Coke and then and then but if you if you want to try straight up whiskey as well, this is definitely a good one to start with. So but uh, I think that's it for us today. Uh, happy Fourth of July. I guess I guess happy Independence Day to you ungrateful colonials a little, a little south of us. So we'll see you guys real soon. Take care everybody.